first thoughts July 17th 2015 doing this again I don't have the plug from my work computer so I have to use the Quizzo computer and it's not the same program and it's dragging and lagging and like I, 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 it's, it's like I'm looking at myself recording this and I feel like I'm in a bad kung fu movie alright anyway yesterday I had all my grandchildren and um, all three of them and it was a great time I love having them all together it, it, they really are sweet together uh, you know when there's three of them it's easier than when it's two of them it's crazy the two of them will fight my you know, brother and sister they go at each other Gavin and Izzy but you know, a little Shay just kind of sits by. But if I just have a little Shay, it's like a pop pop, pop pop, hey pop pop. It's it's endless. It's if if he were a bird, all right, I'd put him in a mine. But anyway, he's not. He's my grandchild, so I will listen to that all day. But I had all three of them yesterday, and I, I, I took them down to uh, Pittman downtown, and there's a new comic book store there, and uh, it's cool, because comic books uh, is a part of my life. I've always, uh, I grew up with comic books. It's how I really learned how to read. I got my vocabulary from it. My grandfather started a tradition. He would take me to a place called the Berlin Auction. Now, the Berlin Auction is, was literally an auction. Seriously, you know, you, I remember my grandfather buying a gross of pens, and then the next night I'm up with two goats. You know, that's, I saw a Jamaican guy and a guy that was uh, had a hood over his head, a Satanist. I was like, oof, I think we got to go pop up, grab the pens. But anyway, it was like a big flea market, and it had like a chicken coop kind of mall. You had a street going that way and one coming back the other way. And that's what you did. You looped it, big loop. And it had like restaurants and food. And you couldn't sit down. You had to lean on the counter, you know. And that's a, that's a Jersey thing. We're leaners. That's right. I, I, I would have thought, honestly, my wife said no, but I, I would have named my daughter Eileen. You know, because she does. But anyway, um, the Burnham Auction had uh, the Pretzel Factory. It had the uh, Peanut Roaster that's like 400 years old. You can get your darks. Ooh, and uh, the pretzels, you can watch them make them. You know, and, and, and they were so cheap and delicious and hot. And then uh, they had, first they had the Crank mustard now they have it's like pornographic it looks like one individual cow order but it's so big you can't get your hand around it and I was like oh god you know I was like <clears throat> now I know what Latoya Jackson yeah. anyway you know and I was uh, it was one of those things where uh, it, it was it was a tradition my grandfather would take me there on Sundays and I would go and buy comic books uh, they were to return, so they had their, their cover ripped in half, and so you couldn't resell them, and they were just something to read. That's how I learned. Got my vocab. So I do that with my grandkids now. You know, uh, After a while, my grandfather started getting me some first editions, you know, and he was like, look, put this one away, you never know. Put this one away, you never know. So I had a bag in my closet where I kept them. It was a zippered up plastic bag. You know, plastic wasn't really... The thing in you know in 1972 it was rare so uh, it was cool it kept out the dust and the light so it worked so anyway so I try and do that with my my kids now so I take them up to the the store and we buy them uh, one that they can read it's on their level smaller words with some new introductory words so it's building a vocabulary one on their level. Okay, and then I get them one from the 50 cent pile where they can just do whatever they want with it. I don't care if they tear it, if they cut it, okay, but that is only those, and they understand that, which is cool. And it's so funny because if you tell a kid he can cut things up, they, they're like, oh no, it's mine. And then I get them a, um, they each have a first run, and I get every month I get the issue for them, and I put it away. I have Spider Gwen for Chelsea or for Shelby. Oh my gosh, for Isabella. Sorry, I just went through my daughter, my niece, and then my granddaughter. I sound like my mother. Anyway, so I I got Spider Gwen for her. I have Groot. I am Groot uh, for little Shay, and uh, Deadpool for Gavin. So they're all different levels. They're all different, but they get put away. And hopefully someday, 
you know, they might be worth some money, and they, you know, hopefully that's my little legacy to them. Um, I, I had, uh, I had an experience with mine. I was a Boy Scout, and I would go away, at, you know, at least one week uh, out of the summer, and I would go to summer camp. I think I was like 11 years old, and uh, I got my, um, I set a record for Troop 123. I got 22 merit badges in one week. I was multitasking like a son of a bitch. I, sh you know, I should be Donald Trump. But, you know, I got other things introduced to my life, and I went, eh, let's just relax. Life is short. So anyway, I, um, I came home, and my mom would always have something surprise for me. You know, she'd either have, you know, uh, a sliding board on the pool, or, you know, there was something. My mom was always doing stuff. She's a sweet lady, and uh, always, her wheels are always spinning. But anyway... I come home, I walk in, and she takes me upstairs to my bedroom and opens the door. And, and the grand entrance. Oh, she's so proud. She's standing there with a big grin. She's like, oh, look what I did for you. And here my mother had uh, gone into my first run bag and uh, painstakingly taken a razor blade and cut out every page, every panel, and uh, wallpapered my bedroom with them. Um, it was beautiful because it was a true gift of love. I know it took her hours upon hours. It was so unique. And Stan Lee didn't have a bedroom look like that. But there was also my college tuition. I just looked and as a tear rolled down my eye, my mother to this day, it was one of the proudest moments. She's like, hit him so deep so I, I cried myself to sleep for the next year just looking up going, <laughs> UCLA Iowa F me love you mommy don't worry I'm over it see you tomorrow